Jeanette Chong, and welcome to New Hive Tonight, a new program that explores bees who aren't satisfied with their seemingly preordained lot in life and now struggle to change their fortunes. The reason this is a new program, of course, is because, well, no bee has ever really done it before. Until now, tonight, the bee who brought the insect and human worlds together. He's touched our hearts and our venom bladders. Barry B. Benson. Thanks for having me. You know, you're shorter in person than you look on TV. I'm told the camera adds five millimeters. Barry, your face is everywhere. T-shirts, posters, books. Your mug is on a mug, for bee's sake. There's even a video game. I hadn't heard about the video game. It's both challenging and entertaining. So tell us, where did your hero's journey begin? Well, as you know, Jeanette, aside from having to break your way out of a wax cocoon at birth, college is one of the most challenging times in a young bee's life. Yes, I remember. I went to BU. Oh, yeah, me too. Well, well, it really is the only school. Go, Go BU. BU. Anyway, Jeanette, it all started for me the day after graduation. I was really trying to figure things out. I see. Take us back, Barry, to that first day. Roll it, Hal. Bye, Mom. Bye, Dad. Gotta go. What? No breakfast? No, thanks. I don't want to be late. I can't believe this day has finally arrived. My boy is going to work at Hunnex. Wait till the girls at the nail place hear my Barry graduated BU with straight B's. None of their sons graduated with straight B's. Now go down there, son, and show them you're a Benson. Don't do that! Your father didn't leave on good terms! Oh, for the millionth time, <sighs> Janet, I did not steal those post-its. Bye, guys. Oh, Martin, will you stop it? What do I need with boxes and boxes of post-its? Hi, Barry. Before we face the challenges of our new lives after graduation, we've got to get a couple of things straight first. Now jump. Now see if you can hover. Now look at the mini-map on the lower right of the screen. It shows you the whole area where you are. These markers will show you the places of interest. Very important for a... Remember, though, I'm still waiting for you over at Hunnex. Check your mini-map if you get lost. Like now, for instance. I'm already waiting for you at the Hunnex entrance. See? If you want to get there faster, go to the next car and ride it up here. You can get into all of the cars in New Hive City. Uh, Barry, um, over, over here. Barry, Barry. Uh, here, Barry. Hi, Adam. I'll tell you, I am excited. Think about it. It's our first day of work. We're about to embark on the next stage of life. Which leaves us only one stage away from death. We're a two-stage species, you know. Just give it a chance. Who knows? You might like it. That's what you said about B. Pilates. I still can't extend this arm all the way out. Sorry, pal, but nothing you say can bring me down today. <laughs> Welcome to Honex, making honey the same tried and true way our ancestors did for the last five million years. Honey is brewed here 24-7, 365 days a year. What about leap year? Every four years, on February 29th, all workers are treated to a free spa day, followed by a concert in the park. Wow, really? Wow, oh, really? Oh, just kidding. We make honey that day, too. Oh. This is my stop. I'll catch you after my shift. Remember, the shift makes the man. You know, that's not really an expression. Oh, never mind. Attention, citizen! Do you want excitement? Do you want adventure? Do you want to serve your hive? Your hive? Your hive? A new job station has just been installed in your neighborhood. Come and see another quality product brought to you by Hunnix, the Hunnix Corporation. A Attention! A new Hunnix job station has just been installed in your neighborhood. Come 
At Honex, we use only the freshest ingredients to make our honey. And now you can help make it even better. Just pick up the freshly steamed honeycombs for processing. It's not easy, but quality never is. Check it out. Are you good enough to join our team? We've got honeycomb. Then here we go. Get ready for the adventure of a lifetime. Listen up, operating the tube is easy. Use the directional keys to move it. Do you want me to repeat my instructions? Hello? Hi. Who is this? It's Adam. Oh, hey. How'd you not know it was me? Don't you have caller ID? Nah, I don't want some guy messing with my antenna. It's unnatural. Anyway, I'm done for the day. Want to share a cab home? I can. I volunteer to work a double shift. Really? Wow. Good for you, Barry. And on your first day, what initiative. You're really trying to make a good first impression, which I think is fantastic. You were being sarcastic, weren't you? Yes, I'll see you at the cab stand in five minutes. hope you enjoy your ride and that you have a pleasant and productive day. What a great first day. I can't imagine anyone having a better first or first of work. I can. What is with you? Can't you enjoy this just a little? What's to enjoy? I mean, it's not like a surprise opportunity here. Ever since I was a larva, the only thing I've heard about is honey. Every minute of the day. It's honey this and honey that. Honey, honey, honey. Everything is honey. Well, there's also wax, but mostly it's honey. What are you saying? I just have to believe there's more to life than making honey. Barry, we're bees. Bees make honey, that's what we do. Spiders spin webs, silkworms weave silk, snails. Uh, well, I don't know what they do, but you know what I'm saying. My point is, Barry, I, I just think you need to go with the flow, you know? Flow? What flow? There's no flow here. Oh, there's Flo. Uh, taxi! So, you coming? Um, you go. I'll catch up later. Attention, citizen! A new cab driving job trial station has just... Driving this beautiful twin-turbo engine late model cab, you'll leave your old job in the dust and get the chance to pick up customers all over New Hive City. You'll need quick reflexes and a sharp eye for directions to really clean up at this job. But if you measure up, the sky is the limit, my friend. Please complete the training certification to take advantage of this wonderful career opportunity. Hey, citizen, you've got taxi jobs galore. Better see what you can finish. Then off we go into a bold new career adventure. Woo! Okay, pal, you know how to handle a setup. Do you want me to repeat my instructions?
Supercharge your life on a heady mix of honey and adrenaline when you get behind the wheel of this mean machine. The Stingray comes outfitted with an arsenal of power-ups and clever tricks that'll give you a much-needed edge in the races you take. But better than the winner circle on that last checkered flag, you'll also be the proud owner of the Super Stinger 3000, which you can race as a pro anytime to build your fortune. Just to let you know, you've still got a race outstanding. Fame and fortune awaits. It's time for some straight up now to use the now. Better get it right, otherwise it's off to the honey mines with you. Oh, just kidding. Oh, what a move! Nice work, pal! Hello, I'm here with Barry B. Benson. You know, that was amazing, Jeanette. It was really almost like being there. Well, we are broadcast in BHD. It has twice the stripes of BTV. Wow, twice the stripes. Now, Barry, just to give our viewers some background, had you ever been outside the hive before? Oh, no. So what happened? What led you to that first day outside? Well, Jeanette, there comes a time in every bee's life when he has to ask himself what he's made of. Is there something more? So you had an itch? Well, I'm not sure it was an itch exactly. There was definitely some tingling, bordering on a Jones, but a little short of a yen. A Jones? A Jones led you to risk it all to fly with the pollen jocks? Jones, yen... Because, you know, I'd heard this all started as a dare. Really? A dare? Hmm. You know, why don't I tell your viewers a little bit about the outside? Please, tell us what you saw that first day. It's been said that just a mere sight of the outside can drive a bee mad. Oh, that's just an old wasp's tail. But it is big and loud. And, well, there is danger around every corner. And don't get me started on the rain. Did you say rain? Pouring rain, crazy rain, and wild animals, and humongous cars, and humans. Humans as far as the eye can see. But other than that, well, let me show you. Uh, Hal, can you roll that? Thanks. You know... I'm going with Dare. Really? Why? It's in my notes. Oh. Listen up, boys. We got ourselves a doozy of a mission, and it needs to be completed ASAP. Oh, I see recruiting standards are getting more lax every day. What's your name, Bug Juice? Barry B. Benson, sir. Nah, he's with us, Lou. We'll keep an eye on him. All right, let's go over the basics one more time. We got a rain advisory today, and no matter what some of you hotshots might think, bees cannot fly in the rain. As always, remember, dogs, birds, frogs, hockey sticks, tennis rackets, brooms, and rolled up magazines are not your friends. Oh, and absolutely no talking to humans. Make me proud, boys. Brown oh, nose petunias, you striped stem suckers. All of your drain nose flowers. Launch! Oh boy. Oh. Watch out for the kites, boys. Just east of the winds, I suggest we use the snake maneuver to get underneath them. It's time for some ground level recon. Echo Delta Niner Victor Golf Foxtrot Bravo Zulu Alpha Niner. 
legendary names are too hard to remember. Go bridge! I'll move! Wow, what a view! Pathetic. Are you kidding? It's so beautiful, it's like a movie. It doesn't look real. I meant you. You want to be a pollen jock? Then where's your pollinator? How are you going to collect the pollen, genius? Stuff it in your pockets? Oh, sorry. Do you know where I could get? There! Now you're a real bee. Wow, you know it's heavier than it looks. If you do your job right, it's about to get a whole lot heavier. Oh, great. First, you gotta sharpen your senses, Grasshopper. Grass Good! Now it's nice work. Just to be sure, extract more pollen from this To rejuvenate withered flowers, lock on by holding the lock on button. Wow, you're a natural. Follow me. Now this is a picture-taking spot. You'll often come across one of these in your adventure. Uh, great! Be sure to take a look at what you've unlocked in the museum once you get back to New Hive City. Now, I'd love to stand here and teach you all day, but we're kind of busy. Go get the flowers pollinated, mister. All right, you only have to press the accelerate button to fly forward and use the directional buttons to direct your flight. Remember, you can always press the dash button to dash. Uh, by the way, the radar can also be a great pollination tool. The yellow dots represent pollen-filled flowers, while the blue dots represent...
on beat. Already? You ain't seen nothing yet! We got trouble! Attention to all jocks! Dragonflies have entered the airspace! Come on, follow me! It's time for some action! All right, you'll sometimes come across enemy resistance. Dragonflies, wasps, and hornets won't hesitate to interfere with our work. The good news is they're allergic to pollen, and you got plenty in your pollinator. Use the right trigger to fire. You can lock on multiple targets at the same time. Try it! Good! By the way, you'll know you're in range to fire when your targets turn green. Be careful, though. Get too close, and they'll fire at you. You can always evade their projectiles by quickly changing directions or by performing a barrel roll using the left barrel roll or right barrel roll buttons. One last thing before I let you go. We bees are equipped with a very neat feature called bee vision. It allows us to better see dying flowers and other things we can interact with. Press the bee vision button to activate it. See how dying flowers and enemies stand out from the rest? You can use this to your advantage. You'll find bee vision has other uses in due time. All right, that's enough for one day or your brain will explode. Go pollinate some more, rookie, and watch out for those nasty dragonflies. You're going down, B. <laughs> Get out of here! Never knew the wild blue yonder could be so exhausting. Gotta catch my breath. That looks like a good place to land. Very yellow. Ooh, soft landing. Careful, guys. It's a bit grabby. Hey, guys, I made it. Hey, new guy, watch it. You don't know what you're dealing with. Oh. Just gonna recharge the old engine here for a sec. Whew.
Nice try. The rain. Okay, I've been informed of your situation, and boy, you've really done it. But look, I'm gonna help you out. Just focus and use your bee reflexes. Remember, it's the bee reflex button. See that awning over there? Now, listen carefully. Once you're all set, activate your bee reflexes with the bee reflex button and go! Hit it again to turn it off. You may have to wait for your senses to charge back up if you use it a lot. Oh, and don't waste it in a safe zone. Okay, now get out of that awning, pronto! Still kicking, I see. Nice work, son. Now, if you want to get out of there ASAP, and I suggest you do, you can get a speed boost by using a wind current. See that over there? That's a wind current. Focus and get to it. Once inside, you'll be swept away fast. But watch out for water drops. Use your B reflex. Use your B reflex. Keep an eye on the reflex meter! That's the way to do it!
looks like a good place to rest. From the light! I repeat, do not go towards the light! Must go towards the light. Hey! That's not the light at the end of the tunnel! It's a so 